the next type of fillet variable radius fillet in this slide you can look the images seat cover hair dryer uh, partial view and the top view of electronic gadget everywhere you can see the edge will have a round but that round will not be constant from start to end it will start here with uh, radius as 20 it can end here as 5 once again it can end with 20 and if you look this component you can understand the geometry and if you look this top view you can see it is clearly shown here and let's see how we can create this in solidworks i'll go to uh, graphical user interface this is a this is a chunk i would like to apply the variable fillet on this edge i'll select this edge before that we need to choose variable as the filler type select this edge and here you can see unassigned and here you can see unassigned i'll make it this uh, first one vertical as uh, twin and here this one as 20 and i need to add here and one more uh, radius that is 5 mm and here i would like to say here it should be once again 20 and this should be once again 5. Now you can see we are applying variable radius on this edge. If you require additional radius to be added, you can increase this point. If not required, you can keep as it is as 3 and you can make it either straight transition or it should be a smooth. But this you can see a difference when you deviate from uh, um, uh, higher radius to lower radius. This is 10 and this i'll make it as uh, not this one and this one i make it as uh, of 1 mm and here now you'll be will be close looking into this geometry and i will say straight transition and smooth transition you can see the difference over here and click ok to create this variable radius on this edge and the next one is face fillet and full round fillet Face fillet is used to apply fillet between non-adjacent faces and non-continuous faces. And full round used to create a round on the whole surface that is between three faces, between three adjacent faces we will apply a round. Let's see how we can create this. I'll close this file and now let's go to the uh, hands-on file available here. I'll open this. And here, first, let's see how we can apply face fillet. I'll go to fillet and use face fillet. And here, uh, I would like to apply uh, this face and uh, this face. And here, we need to give the radius as 50. Yeah, you can see the radius that is the fillet has been created. And just click OK here. Now you got this face fillet. And now let's see how we can create full round. Go to fillet once again full round select this first face second adjacent face and third adjacent face now you can see full round is created similarly we can create another side selecting this first face second face and third face click now you got full round on the two faces and this is how you can apply full round and there is one more interesting feature in SOLIDWORKS which we discussed earlier in the sketcher environment that is sketch expert. Similarly, in fillet we have fillet expert which we call as an inbuilt intelligent feature in SOLIDWORKS. And this is an uh, this is an uh, basic uh, base feature. Now I would like to apply fillet on the edges. We'll go and we'll select this edge and we'll apply. I'm sorry. What I will do is constant radius. Uh, now. What I will do is I will select this one single edge, but I need to apply similarly on the all the edges. But what we will do, we will go and select manually all the edges. But when you have fillet expert, what you will do is you will select one edge. It will give you a uh, call out where it will give you an option. You want to select the whole feature or the entire body or only the vertical edges. And you can apply a radius how much you need and apply here. And once you apply this, if you want to modify once again, you can select this. Go to change, select this feature and say it has to be resized as 5 mm and give resize. Only this edge will be resized. This is the advantage of fillet expert. Similarly, you can modify the corners and you can also add the fillets one by one as per your requirement. 
it's all about fillet in solid works